continue. Oh my god, this is terrible. This is not desirable in any sense. Get up! Don't lose your class, Gamer Storms. No, Gamer Storm. Well, no. In Raiden. Run. They have no arms. I am lightning. Oh my god. Transformed. <laughs> if he cut off his other arm with his own arm, or maybe his mouse. Oh my god. Uh oh. Neck is getting his in the bag. Thank you for the reason. The server room. The corridor's full of microwaves. Microwaves. One of us is enough. My body is a machine. I can take it. Your body may be. You a ever machine, put metal in a microwave? But your heart is human. You've got a life to go back to. She means nothing to me now. Run! Look at me. Do you still have your youth? Don't waste it. You can start over. <laughs> it's cyber arms. You're on. This is my fight. I. We. Tore the world apart. Made your life a living hell. It's my duty to put an <laughs> end duty. to all of this. Yes! Do I get this the sword? All 
right. I'll make sure they don't get through. Stay with me, Snake. <laughs> Hold on until we insert the virus. Chill in there. <laughs> Why don't they have guns? Zap them all, baby. Oh man, oh man. I need some badass mouth spinning, mouth sword spinning action. Oh god. Lock it from the inside. Done. Not, not Mark Three. Thank you. Don't do that. How do you even choreograph a fight scene? Well, I guess I'll, I guess we might see.
Oh no, Mark three. Jesus Christ. The real guy. We're running out of time. Main X, good. What the hell? Move! Move! <sighs> um... Eat self for stamina. Cooked snack. Delicious. the anti-microwave -mic injection? So this is GW. He's <laughs> just like, oh, all right. Thanks for getting in there. Those? It's like a graveyard in here. Those big boss graves? Oh, God. Can you do it? Leave it to me. Patriots. Something was wrong with the rendering of... Oh. Well, that makes sense then. Lightning. Shot in the feet and then got with each other.
one. Controlling their emotions, and now they're going. Right, right. Snake. Gotcha. Thank you for the reminder. We just need to go back through the microwave. Wait a minute. The worm is still spreading. And it's not stopping at GW. Is it removing the other clones? No. Wait. I don't believe this. Uh-oh. Naomi. Uh-oh. What is it? JD is being erased. to destroy all four AIs, along with JD, the core that tied them all together. I've set this video to play back once they're all gone. Sons of the Patriots was only the beginning. The Patriots were planning to use nanomachines to implement the system over the entire population. I had an obligation to stop it. With a little help from Sunny. She helped me. She believed her talents could help you all put GW to rest. What she created was an anti-AI fox dye. But this virus's name Fox is alive. Fox alive. It's the conceptual opposite of the nano machines that I created all those years ago. We wish to free the captured foxes, to let them run free in the wild.
the time you hear this, I'm afraid I'll be gone. <laughs> it's a strange feeling, leaving a message to be delivered after you've died. <sighs> <laughs> if you're listening I'm sorry Sorry I deceived you I'm sorry I had sex with your corpse anything else Lying to you like that <laughs> I wanted to apologize to you before, but I never got the chance. <laughs> me. And yet, in the end, you helped me feel the joy of living. I don't want to save because Snake died, so let's just go back to the last checkpoint. We did something wrong, so we need to save Snake. <clears throat> just kidding. When the last rose petal falls, then the his affliction is cured by... I don't know. <laughs> Can't restart the mission this time. <laughs> Snake, wait here. I'll get a medic. Oh, there was a resub from Foxhound. Thank you so much, Foxhound, for the resub. Enough. Stop this pointless fighting. and shine, Snake. Look, the war is over. Why? You could have stopped us. I stopped you. Why would I want to do that? No! Oh. This is just as I'd hoped things would end. Back before father's time, before Zero gave birth to the Patriots, the U.S., China, and the Soviet Union formed a secret pact. Oh, always with the fucking 
Takeaways. The organization they created was called the Philosophers. Through two world wars, it spread its roots and extended its reach. After that, the Philosophers splintered, and factions began to squabble over the fortune they'd amassed. They called it the Philosophers' Legacy. Are you really explaining this A to like 99% dead later snake? Provide the foundation for Zero's Patriots. Zero sought to use his riches to achieve world domination. Our father, Big Boss, sought to free himself from that chokehold. Right, his right. dream was to create an army of free citizens, one that answered to no government. Outer heaven. But he failed because of you. Nine years ago, I tried to free us from the control of our genes. Four years later, our dear brother Solidus sought to free us from the control memes. of the means. All of that, the all memes. of it, was nothing more than a process of trial and error. The end result of which is outer haven. To be free from sons of the Patriots. The ultimate form of external control imposed on the Patriot soldiers. Free from Fox Die. Free from the system. Free from ID control. Our minds free from their prisons. <laughs> uh, just the haven I uh, yearned for. Yeah. You have an elk assault, sir. Oh, he does. He does have an elk assault. In a needle. Oh my god. This is it, brother. Our final moment. The battle has ended. But we are not yet free. The war is over. We still have a score to settle. <sighs> Those are expensive. Show me what you got. Oh boy. Just up. Oh, no, oh, damn. All right. Bloodied. Oh. 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 <laughs> oh. <laughs> Fuck finger.
R1. Try to dodge. Try to dodge. <clears throat> I pressed R1. It was definitely there, like, in time. Oh, hold it. Don't know 
Exist? Continue. Oh. Exit. Probably said exit. Seemed like it said exist. for controls. No, I'm doing good. I like this fight. <clears throat> if there's a way to make it easier, then I don't want to. <laughs> JP Pro, thank you for the resub. Tylenol, thanks for the resub as well. Oh, 
Move forward as he charges in. Close that gap. gets the fuck you punch. Fucking uh, the edge enabled that. But I stayed close enough, close enough to him when I dodged. Now. No! I was trying to move in for a combo instead of do the charging. But it's got a lingering, got a lingering hitbox there. Fine. Can I take advantage of that? Nice. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Figuring out the weak points. Vulnerabilities. Come on. You want to punch? You Yep. 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 Shit. I'm getting against the back. <laughs> Redirect. Oh, now we have stamina. What? Take this. What? What? What a thrill. What a thrill. What a thrill. Oh, shit, I missed that. Take this. Take this. I'm searching. This is gonna take Take time to die. I'm about to get knocked out. Fuck! Oh. What the hell? Oh, I pressed fucking triangle. Tree frog, the 
the fullness of life. <sighs> <laughs> You're pretty good. Thank you for the reset, Evil Elite. Sonny's program destroyed JD's brain, but left the brain stem intact. She analyzed Naomi's black box and separated the Patriot's control system from the vital lifelines of society. Water, air, electricity, food, medicine, communication, transportation. She cut off the Patriot's control while preserving modern civilization. Maybe it was her way of avenging Olga, her mother. Or maybe she wanted to shape the future into her own ideal image. Or maybe it was just one big defragmentation. I'm sorry, how is Snake alive? Fox alive. The AI is truly living thing. The Patriot's reign has crumbled away. And still, our civilization, a civilization that has thrived on war since the dawn of time, lives on. I wonder if we did the right thing. Naomi. What did we lose? What did we save? <laughs> Grab into your butts. Epilogue. Make it sin. You look 
amazing. Barrel. Congratulations. Drama! Colonel. You're going to walk me down the aisle. Oh, I thought you were going to kill me! You're not angry anymore. That's usually what happens when you point guns at people. Oh, I'm still mad. Loaded guns. But now, you've got a chance to win me over. Wait, she's going to marry your dad? Hair, though. <laughs> what? Mei Ling, please. Meryl. You look beautiful. <laughs> Your biceps are so big. Wait, so they are getting married. Just kidding. Oh, this is actually... Yeah, though, I guess, yeah. Those dudes! Not a big, uh... Not a big reception, huh? give thanks for the life they will soon share and pray they have love everlasting now let's all send this new team on their first mission <laughs> have sex in the back of a fucking v VW van do it Oh, oh. <laughs> That's an empty scene. God damn it, Drebin. Just in time. Drebin. And I brought gifts. A shower of flowers, compliments of Drebin. Is he trying to steal, steal Akiba's woman? Akiba. A little something extra for me. Now lock on him with the Metal Gear Rex. It's a young Hawaiian boy. 
really sunny. Really. Oh my god. Where's the monkeys, mate? The bouquet. Oh, shit. Hey, Lang, you got to fat to tentacles for the rest of your life. Otacon's so much cuter since Metal Gear Solid 1. Campbell. Snake. Neck. Thank you. He's like right in front of him. You're welcome. Snack. I got it. There's gameplay. Gameplay complete. Oh no. Neck? Snack? Raiden. What? <laughs> that kid. Jack, how are you <sighs> feeling? Can I shake the controller? Do you mind if I sit down? He had boob jiggle, but I'm not sure if that was built into the... Nah, it was definitely built into the cutscene. Jack. Don't shut me out. I need you to listen to me. What do you want? You come to laugh at me? Oh, no. Look. I stole this boy Look at scout. The boy. Kid. No. Get real. He's yours. I don't have any kids. Not a chance. Oh my god, his arms. He's your son. Don't touch his. You said miscarriage. I lied. Oh. I had a healthy baby boy. Oh. Good. I love you because you lied. Roy pretended to be my husband to protect me and our son. Only until you completed your mission to shield us from Patriot eyes. What? I don't want him. <laughs> He sacrificed everything, even his family, 
to protect us. I don't believe it. I'm sorry, Jack. I wanted to tell you. So he's really... John, aren't you going to say hello? Little John. Jack John Rose. Jack John. Scared of me, huh? I don't blame you. I'm a monster. It's okay. Here. I think you're cool. Kind of like a comic book superhero. Get that haircut. And I'm no longer afraid. Why do people only cry out of one eye and not from their tear ducts? I'll never leave you alone again. I guess tears do normally come from there, too, though. <clears throat> Base pierced together, uh, pieced together, too. Like a scene from Beauty and the Beast. Don't say that. Hate that movie. You no, know, Beast. Oh. You're my husband. And his father. And me. I'm going to do my very best. Whatever. To be the wife and mother this family deserves. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. No. Neck. Big boss. Regular boss. Liquid. Hmm. All boss. War 
has changed. Our time has ended. Our war is over. But there's one more thing I must do. I never skip the credits. Shut up! Stop! Why would I skip the credits if I watched the hour ending cutscene? One last punishment Shepherd. I must endure. Erase my genes. Wipe this meme from the face of the earth. Meme. This is my final mission. Knowing Snake, I'd be willing to bet that it doesn't kill him for some reason. A stiff drink, huh? I didn't know you drank. I thought it was strictly soda for you. Not like I never touched the stuff. Soda just agreed with the nanos better. <laughs> the nano machines break down alcohol before it has a chance to get you drunk. So that explains it. No need to hold back anymore, huh? Yeah, well, it ain't all sunshine and rainbows. A lot of folks lost their entire sense of being the moment SOP went offline. You mean SOPS? I heard some people are going through withdrawals. SOP syndrome. Right. Yep. Sops! SOP kept more than just alcohol under control. Those poor slobs are virtually naked now. From what I hear, over 10% are showing symptoms. I guess getting rid of the Patriots won't solve all our problems overnight. You, uh, probably already suspected this, but I'm not actually an employee of AT Security. Uh huh? The Patriots raised me to be a gun locker. <laughs> the Patriots? My earliest memories are of the LRA. They kidnapped me, forced me to fight. Yep, you're staring at a former child soldier. My parents, brothers and sisters, all killed in the of war. Of course, he's got a backstory that too. What you call a war orphan. Right along After with the that, beauties. The Patriots picked me up and brought me into the family business. I was Drebin, number 893. There's a whole lot of pawns like me all over the world. 
How do you suppose I laundered guns like I did? Because <laughs> they let me. In fact, Everyone is a child soldier. I was under strict orders to back you guys from the start. You what? Hey, man. Don't take it personal. I wasn't the only one under their orders. Huh? Huh. Meryl and... They probably never realized it themselves, but... Rat Patrol Team Zero One. Obviously, Liquid's plot was a threat to the Patriots. So they planned to have you guys take care of me. Didn't turn out quite how they planned, though, did it? Yeah, well, I don't think they expected you to crash their system and wipe them out. So, does that mean you're out of a job now? <laughs> Are you kidding? I got the dreaded. All the Drebbins in the world are in on it. From now on, we're in business for ourselves. We are pawns no more. Yeah! Yeah. The White House might have lost its taste for unilateralism, started to rebuild. But there's a lot of failed states out there that went bankrupt from their PMC habits. And they owe a shitload of money. Now, only question is, who's gonna pick up the tab? I'm sure these new governments will try and keep it under control with PMC corporate reform laws, but it ain't gonna be good enough. They all sunk up to their eyeballs in the war economy. The war economy? It might not be a new world order, but the old order under the war economy is gone for good. I'm guessing the UN is going to be more important than ever. What with multilateralism, you know. A certain president said it best back during the Cold War. <laughs> For in the development of this organization rests the only true alternative to war. What are you talking about? We're just partying because we just had yeah, a wedding. Yeah, Come on. The UN itself is just an old 20th century relic. If you think about it. Who are you talking you to? Look at its history. It ain't that different from the Patriots. Ah, uh, that's right. The nano machines used to keep you sober. Crush. Mix. Consume. Burn. Burn. Repeat. Oh. Crush. Mix. Burn. Hey, Uncle Hal. Can I give him the Mark Three? Huh? He's kind of a new friend. <laughs> Can I give here. him the piece of mili military language, technology <laughs> to the kid that He's my very first outside I can't friend. talk to? <laughs> uh, That's great. <laughs> fuck no! Sonny, you can't give him that shit. It's okay if you want to live outside now. You're on your own. Bye. It's your life. There's apartment keys. There are other havens out there. The sun looks so pretty. Look at those leg wraps. Sunny. I like it outside. Uncle Hal, when is Snake coming back? 
Catches needs to be alone. Thickness. I wonder if I'll ever see him again. Snake had a hard life. He needs some time to rest. Well, that's it. Guess there's nothing else to see. I'm gonna skip the credits now, if you don't mind. Um, just gonna press the, where's the skip credits button on this thing anyways? All right, that's enough cries. NASCAT, thank you for the resub. Welcome back to the pack. Thank you for a year. Years worth of support. Yep, or riot. Look how fuzzy my hair is. It's so glittery. Richard Doyle. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh. Sorry. What? Somebody else That's shot right. the gun out of his hand? Good. No need for you to go just yet. All right, I'm skipping this. Is that zero? Is that big boss? Big boss. Big butt. I didn't recognize him. Debriefing. Got the boss's weapon. Daddy. Chaos way. 
I missed most Ready, of the go. ending movie. Play it again, Kappa. My son. You I ending ruiner. Fight. Or should I call you brother? What? It's over. Time for you to put aside the gun and live. AIs that came after him that was convinced that Solidus was me. I'm here to break immersion and chew bubble gum and I'm all out of Alright! Alright! <laughs> state of eternal sleep. I'm stopping the donations. By JD and the proxy AI. They had me sealed away completely. Not only my physical body, but my will too. The technology was similar to what they used to restrain the B&B &B members you encountered. For me to wake again, the system had to be destroyed. One way or another. Ocelot and Eva wanted two things. To bring me back to life, and to end the Patriots. That meant destroying the AI, and killing the man. JD and Zero. Right before you uploaded the virus into GW, the way to JD was opened, but only through the physical manifestation of GW. That's when we finally learned the location of this man, Zero. For me, and for them, for Naomi, nothing was more important. And it was for that that they put their grand scheme into motion. Eva stole my body from them and reconstructed it by replacing the missing parts with pieces from liquid and solidus. Uh. And Ocelot, uh. in order to fool the system, Use nanomachines and psychotherapy to transplant Liquid's personality onto his own. He used hypnotic suggestion to turn himself into Liquid's mental doppelganger. For all our advances in nanotechnology, information and genetic control, they've never managed to control people at will, let alone turn one person totally into another. Under certain conditions, someone can be made to play a specific role. Act like someone else. Cats. Cats? do love to play as snakes. What? It all started with him. I haven't heard that one. Zero. There's zero! Zero grew old, and by the end, his patriots were being run by a network without shape or form. What do you mean, without shape or form? The proxies were only one small part of the vast cycle that Zero created. The corporations, for-profits, 
and research institutions that comprise the military-industrial complex were part of it too. They operated on budgets automatically allotted to them by the proxies. Accounts maintained by the Patriots. The network covered everything from weapons, R&D, and investment to production and marketing. It encompassed the people, the companies, even the laws that protect them. Politics and economics became nothing more than iterations of the same oppressively uniform system. I don't think anyone realized that it was all a setup, a mere set of norms. The Patriots were those norms, a neural network reduced to its simplest form. That's what they really represented. Uniformity without individual will, without change. But then one day, those norms suddenly deviated from that pattern and underwent a mutation. It was like the birth of a new life form. The system found a new way to propagate itself. War. The norms the Patriots had crafted for their unified state quickly became dependent on a single business, the war economy. Meanwhile, the political cause of creating a cleaner, safer battlefield provided a convenient catalyst. By then, the system was no longer being steered by Zero's will or anyone else's. It was then that the norms manifested as AIs, the inheritors of Zero's will, began to reproduce and take on a life of their own. Zero's original intent was to carry on the boss's will and establish a unified world state, an inside world. But his successors failed to carry on his will. Eventually, JD became the very age itself propagating its will as it pleased, and this age chose to act through economics instead of nation-states. Powered by the industrial and digital revolutions that came before it, this age gave birth to a twisted economic revolution. I can still A zoom. battlefield revolution. It created a new world without substance. In this new Metal world, your solid there substance? were no ideologies, no principles, no ideals, not even the thing she treasured most, loyalty. There was only the war economy. It was a colossal error in judgment, one zero couldn't possibly have foreseen. With the American system in a state of collapse, Patriot society has reverted to a blank slate. This man was the source of it all. And he doesn't even realize it. He's completely unaware of the fact that he led the world to the brink of ruin. It seems like he's generally unaware of everything. Even with so much bad blood between us. Especially his fashion choice. Now that I'm actually face to face with him again, the hatred is gone. All I feel is a deep sense of longing and pity. Did Zero really hate me? Or did he fear me? Too late to ask him now. What? The original members. Paramedic. Sigint. Eva. Ocelot. They've all passed on. Only Zero is left. Everything has its beginning, but it doesn't start at one. It starts long before that, 
in chaos. The world is born from zero. The moment zero becomes one is the moment the world springs to life. One becomes two, two becomes ten. That ten becomes one hundred. Not yeah. how counting works. Taking it all back to one solves nothing. So long as zero remains, one will eventually grow to one hundred again. Uh, bi <laughs> binary. And so, our goal was to erase zero. Even the mighty patriots began with a single man. That one man's desires grew huge, bloated, absorbed technology, began to manipulate the economy. We realized too late that we had created a beast. We had helped turn zero into 100. His sin was ours. And for that reason, I'm taking it upon myself to send zero back to nothing. I brought him here to kill him in front of you. Pretty brutal. before. Today will mark the third. The fox die zero planted in you. It's already begun eating away at my body. Truth is the fox die in you is what killed Eva and Ocelot. What are you talking about? Hail me. What? She told me everything. I mean, Eva did get, like, blown up or something. What's wrong? Right? Or shot. Not blown up, but, you know. They did it again. Oh, they used you to kill me. Oh, oh, the Patriots know their proxies in order to bury us. They did it again. In the end, they're no more than a program. Oh, all they can do is repeat the same pattern over and over again. Oh, oh. Dad. Do me a favor, will you? Take me over to her. Oh. Mom. There's one more thing Naomi wanted me to tell you. About the oh, old fox die in your body. The one that 
mutated. The new Vox die uh, inside you continues to multiply. At the same time, it is preventing the old mutated Vox die from reproducing. The new Vox die is uprooting the old. Naomi confirmed it in her follow-up. The mutants are receding. Before long, they'll be gone entirely. Does that mean the mutant strain won't cause an epidemic? Oh. It will only live as long as you do. <laughs> but even then, the process will just repeat itself. One day, the new Vox die too will start to mutate and become a new threat. Mm. Uh, uh, that is, if you manage to live that long. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Am I going to die? Everybody dies. Everyone dies. Yeah! That's the answer. You can't stop it. You can't run away from it. Let me tell you something. Don't. Don't waste the life you have left fighting. I... How do you... Never thought of you... As a son... You have a normal life... After... But Nick... I've always... Happened. Respected you... As a soldier... And... As a man... If you'd been in my place... Back then... Maybe you wouldn't have made the same mistakes that I did. Ever since the day I killed the boss with my own hands, I was already dead. last I understand the meaning behind what you did at last I understand the truth behind your courage Bible thumb seven It's almost time for me to go. 
happened with me. The last ember of this fruitless war dies out. And at last, those old evils will be gone. Once the source of evil returns to zero, a new one, a new future will be born. That new world is yours to live in, not as a snake, but as a man. Zero and I, liquid and solidus, we all fought a long, bloody war for our liberty. We fought to free ourselves from nations and systems and norms and ages. But no matter how hard we tried, the only liberty we found was on the inside. Trapped within those limits. The boss and I may have chosen different paths, but in the end, we oh my, this were both trapped inside the same cage. Liberty. Oh. You have the flowers, please. But you, you have been given freedom. Freedom to be outside. You are nobody's tool now. No one's toy. You are no longer a prisoner of fate. You are no longer a seed of war. Oh, it's time for you to see the outside world with your own eyes. Your body and your soul are your own. Forget about us. Live for yourself. Smoke this shit. Oh, never mind. <coughs> if that cigar woke him up.
This is good. Isn't it? You talked a lot. Can I talk now? And thus, the boss's grave was set on fire. <laughs> 